and welcome back. Well, Harold Jones of Crete was one of the kindest and most giving people that you could ever want to meet. And last Saturday, Harold passed away at the age of 81. In the fall of 2013, Lance Schwartz featured this lifelong humanitarian in a memorable edition of Lance's journal. In honor of Harold, we are sharing that story with you again. And in watching it, you'll get a good feel as to why Harold was such a special guy. This is how you do it after you get loaded up, you get permission to go and you get in and get on your way. This little green machine has held a special place in Harold's heart for a long time. Harold's mini train was built in the Havelock shops in Lincoln in 1976. He bought it in 1986. Little did he know at the time, this amazing little train would provide thousands and thousands of smiles over the next quarter century. Yes, I do. I enjoy every time I take it out. I've met some fine, fine people just because of the train. Harold's mini train has thrilled riders for more than a decade here at Bellwood Days near Columbus. This goes about nine miles an hour, which is pretty fast for something like this. But donating his time, train, and talents to Camp Quality since 1991 is what has left the most lasting impression on Harold's life. Those kids that have cancer, they've never had a chance to enjoy life. That's all they know is doctors. And I think the most rewarding thing I've done is being involved with uh, Camp Quality. This guy is a natural born giver. Well, I've been to 53 cancer camps across the United States, and I stayed a week at each one, so therefore I've donated a year of my life to kids with cancer. And why did you do that? What, what can I say? <laughs> How does that make you feel when, you, uh, when you're given of your time and your energy? Well, it makes me feel good because I like kids. It's fun to have a ride on the train with your family. Tom Parker admires what his friend has done over the last few decades. Well, Harold's just an overall good guy. Uh, anybody that operated this thing for 25 years never took a nickel for doing it. Uh, pretty special guy. Well, it was a good investment. No matter what happens to it, it was a good investment because I truly enjoyed doing this. And so not long ago, Harold took a fall while he was delivering, appropriately enough, Meals on Wheels mm -hmm. in Crete. Yeah, that unfortunate fall, combined with Harold's declining health from Parkinson's, led him to pass away. And he was laid to rest this morning. There is a celebration of his life today at 11 a.m. at the United Church of Christ in Crete. Mm -hmm. Uh, everybody that uh, I've talked to about Harold, they say he's a wonderful man, you yeah. know, and it's really great to hear that and the giving back that he did. Just wonderful. A legacy there. Mm -hmm. We'll get a check of the weather after the break, but first your farm markets. Mm -hmm. 